Welcome, in this video I'll show you how to fix GTA 5, an error occurred while authenticating with Rockstar Games Services. Alright, if you find this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. The first up, if you have Steam, Epic Games and Rockstar Games opened in the background, just go to the bottom right, right click on it, hit on exit, Steam as well. If you have the game on Steam, close it. Or if you have Rockstar Games running in here, just close it as well. Also to double check, just go ahead over to the taskbar, right click on a blank space, now click on Task Manager. In here, again, just go ahead and find any Epic Games, Steam, or Rockstar Game related services, okay? If you can spot one, just right click on it and hit on and Task. Once that's done, first thing that you need to do is uh, disable any VPN, okay? Once done, go ahead over to your uh, File Explorer, and here make sure that the drive where the game is installed got a free space. For example, you would need a 50 gig available space right here for GTA 5 to run smoothly. Okay, once done, if you have one drive running, please disable it for now. Okay, if you spot one drive right here, just disable it. And then once done, open up Rockstar Games Launcher first. Double click on it. Wait for it to load. And once it loads, just make sure to log in. Once logged in, you can now go ahead and open up either Steam or Epic Games, wherever you bought the game. Okay, for example, Steam, select an account, and then in here, just go ahead over to library and launch the game, and it should work now. Now, if that still will work, go ahead and close everything right here. Now, go to your search bar and type in CMD, hit on enter, and it in here, just type in ipconfig space forward slash flash DNS, hit enter, type in ipconfig, space for slash release hit enter ip config space for slash renew hit on enter and then once that's done go and type in net sh space winsock okay space reset hit on enter net sh space int space ip space reset hit on enter and once done you can just go ahead and type in exit and you're good to go. Now, if the commands didn't work, just go ahead over to your search bar, make sure that you run CMD as administrator and just retype the codes that was shown. Okay. Once that's done, go ahead and restart your computer. And after that, relaunch the game and it should work now. Now, if that still will work, go ahead over to your search bar right here, type in control panel. Okay. Open it up, and here at the top right, make sure that it is set to large icons, okay? Once done, click on Network and Sharing Center. And then in the left panel, click on Change Adapter Settings. Double click on the network that you're currently using. Click on Properties. Go to uh, TCP IPv4, click on it, and click on Properties. And in here, just click this option or radio button. Use the following DNS server addresses, okay? You can go ahead and try this one. 8.8.8.8 and 8.8.4.4 and once done just hit on OK, launch the game and check if it helps. Now if that's it will work, type in 1.1.1.1 and 1.0.0.1 and after that just hit on OK, close everything right here, launch the game and everything should work perfectly fine now. That is it. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.